hi guys i am new to youtube i am finja the ninja and today i'm going to be showing you how to make a a new bracelet that i invented you will need six green bands seven blue bands Drop them. Mm. My bands are going everywhere. One second. And twelve white bands. I call it the centipede bracelet. And this is how you make it. So you take your loom, make sure that all the sides are even. Make the arrow pointing away from you, so like this for me. So make sure that the arrow is not on the far side. Take your take a white band and loom it from the first to second peg, like this. Just stretch it across. So right now your loom should look like this, and then push it down and get the next band and do the same thing except from second to third so it should look like this now push that one down and then continue doing this until you reach the end of the loom i'm not going to show this footage because it's just me doing the same step over and over and over again And don't worry if you're not caught up, or if you don't know what to do, just pause, just um, pause the video or redo the vi the video, uh, and you should be able to figure it out. And if you're not caught up with me right now, just pause pause the video. So, once you're done doing that, your loom should look like this. Each peg should have one band on it. And, uh, well, each middle peg should have one band on it. And now, what you do is you take a green band and you hook it right across here so you need to go like this and then you take a blue band and do the same thing except one peg up and then you can and then you take a green band and do the same thing except one peg up and i'm going to not show show this part again because i'm just me doing the same step over and over and over again so stay tuned and if you're not caught up just um pause the video and if you don't know what to do rewind the video and you should be able to figure it out And if you see my eyes wander off of the screen, that just means that I'm looking at um what I'm do what I'm doing on the video.
if this is taking a little bit longer than it took you, it's just because somehow I goofed up and I just had to redo it. And now, since your loom should look like this, so a band across where you put all of your other bands, take your hook, and wait, first, you will need a one last white band. You will take it, you will fold it in, into a figure eight, like this and then you will fold that in half and then put it around your finger so you should have something that looks a bit like this and now you put it on the last band right here we put across the last peg And now, what you need to do is take your hook, push back the capping band, like put it in the little hole, cavity of the um, rainbow loom peg, push back the capping band, and the across band pull up the band pull up the white band of the one that you moved across the center and take it and pull it back to where it started and you should it should look like this and then you pretty much do that across all of them so on the next one instead of pushing back the capping band you will go down push back the um across band take the band that Take the white band and put it on the one where it started and then do that all the way across. I'm not going to show you this footage, but what it should look like is right is like this and um I'm not going to show the footage because it is me doing the same thing over and over and over again. And sorry if I um, accidentally put the loom in front of the camera sometimes. And now... If you're not caught up with me, if your loom does not look like this, then either you've done something wrong or you're not caught up with me. So if you're not caught up with me, just pause the video and do as I instructed. And now what you need to do is pull off all of the bands, pull all of the bands off of the loom very carefully but firmly all, all, firmly is also known as keep a, keep a strong hand oh wait I forgot to do one thing you have to like if you if you mess up um on accident it's okay I did too I do that too you have to get a C or S clip or O clip whatever kind of clip you use I, I'm using a C clip, so it'll look like this, and you take it, and on the first one, so make it on the first one with the arrow point pointing away from you, 
that first one. Put the C clip or S clip or O clip or giant C clip on the white band that's been loomed on the first one. And now start taking the bands off. And um, it should stay together now that you've put on the C clip and slash S clip or O clip or any whatever kind of clip you use. And uh, um, now you take it off of the loom. And uh, I'm not going to show this footage either because it's just me pulling it off of a loom. I'm going to show part of it now. Right now. So what you do is you take it and you just pull it off of the pegs. So you just pull off. So it should be pretty easy. And you just do that all the way down. And then now you have the new bracelet that I've invented. So now you can attach the C clip on the on the first peg. Well, on the first band to the bands on the end so the two white bands on the end and don't worry when you take it off the band it won't come apart because the last band is has been put in a figure eight form so it should not be able to, able to unravel and now you have what i like to call a centipede bracelet see, see you next time